All right, sir. Hello. How are you doing today, son? So you're a uh, you're child laborer. You're like around 11 years old. All right, well, I'm just going to ask you a few questions about your job. So how do you feel about working with men who have significantly more experience and skill than you do? Well, it's hard to get used to working with adults in a job that's pretty much full of adults. Yeah, that makes sense. Other than age, what do you feel is a major setback for you in your work? Um, I get sick a lot because the working conditions and the factories are so poor. And some of the jobs that I do are just harder for children. How do you feel work conditions could be improved for children? Could you be provided with simpler, more fitting roles? Yeah, I think I could, there should be jobs that are easier for like children, and also the conditions can be better, like the air I breathe every day is not that good. Uh, do you feel the work you're doing is actually benefiting your family, or does it not make a difference considering the wage gap between child workers and men? I feel like it does make a small difference because now my family has almost enough money to live comfortably. How does it feel to make, how does it feel to see other children playing in the street, enjoying their childhood while you're on your way to a painstaking job? I just wish I got to have a childhood like children of the upper class family. Alright, well, nice to meet you. Thank you for letting me ask you those questions. How are you doing today, sir? I'm going to hurry you. So, do you feel that the conditions that your workers work in are dangerous or unhealthy? Uh, the workers' conditions are sufficient enough. I think my workers need to get over their laziness and accept that they have this job and then if they get over their laziness, we can increase the profit margin. Do you believe that the immigrants and children that work for you deserve to be paid more? Uh, everyone has started somewhere. They should be grateful for the opportunity and thankful for the food that they're waging and providing. Do your workers get lunch breaks often? Uh, lunch breaks are for the weak and lazy. I mean, except the strongest, most determined workers here. Yeah. Don't you think it's a fire hazard to lock your workers in their factories throughout the whole day? Well, if we don't lock the doors, the workers will easily be able to skip work. And if we lock the doors, there's no need for an escape because the fire is unlikely. How do you feel your factories produce a positive effect on the world? Uh, I believe we are changing the world. My factory system should be a model for the rest of the factories and the new businesses that are rising every day. Okay. Well, it's a pleasure. Thank you for having me. Yeah.